Welcome, welcome, welcome. <clears throat> welcome, welcome. All right, so we're gonna do my little scorps, my scorps, my scorps. I'm gonna do a short video too uh, later on scorps. A few more things I wanted to talk about. Um, <clears throat> it's really the the sexual connection I wanted to break down for you guys, so you can explain. It will explain why you feel the way you feel. Okay. Um, but right now, this is my raw love, my scorps, my scorps. My scorps, my scorps, my scorps. I just felt like Fergie. Fergie. And the, you know what I wanted to say is uh, Nelly Furtado. I don't know if she has nothing to do with it, but <clears throat> maybe for somebody. Wow. Wow, my little scorps. Is that a thing? Am I able to do that? <laughs> I kind of just like me to get a little more cozy. Scorps, my scorps. Wow. Alright. Yeah. What is going on with my fingers right now, my little scorps? My scorps. Oh, love. There we go. There we go, yo. There we go, yo. So what's so what's the scenario? Alright. Let's see. Let's find out. The hermit, the hermit is popping and making an appearance. All right. All right, so we have the four of worlds and the two of cups. Let's get one more. So this is the four of pens just talks about. <sighs> to me, it's, it's shining. It, it's pushing through. Okay. Um, the bottom of the deck, we have the breakthrough. Reversed. I just want to be close to you as on. Well. you want me to? I just want to be close to you. All right, it's... um. Who sings this? Max something. Um, to me, it's like, you're not holding on like this. This is a very sexual card. This actually represents, um, I almost said tentacles, but it's testicles in the penis. Okay. Um, so to me, this is like, you, you know, it's funny when I was talking about like the intensity when it comes to a sexual matter. I was, I was talking about horses just trying to, like, break out of the barn and just, like, kick their way out. You know, like, this is how intense it is for you guys right now. There's definitely some spiritual stuff going on. Um, look at the blue smoke right there. I don't know if that's, like, an orgasm. Okay. This, this card is like that, guys. All right. So, that's, whoa. <laughs> right next to the two of cups. Okay. So, whoa. Whoa. And it's funny because I just mentioned the whole sex thing, so I think it's probably going to come up strong in your read anyway. But there's a little confusion, all right? And with the breakthrough being reversed, it's like it's it's almost coming because the chariot's reversed too. So it, it's either it's coming, but you don't want to um, pursue it. This isn't bad confusion, though. I, I think this is sexual confusion, because look at the color. Um, so, on that note, my little scorps, some of you might be sexually confused. Oh. You might actually be attracted to an opposite sex right now. I mean, the same sex. And if you are the same sex, you might actually be attracted to the opposite sex. And it's like, what is going on? Okay. Some of you might like, even like a best friend. 
you know, with the two of cups, like all of a sudden, like, where's this attraction coming from? Like, what is this? That's for some. If that's the case, okay, I'll talk about that later, all right, um, in my video. So if that's the case for you guys, come back and watch that, okay. Um, wanna be close to you. Spork, spork, spork. There's that chemistry. It's like a magnetic pull, all right, right under, right under, uh, uh, the genitals, okay, we have give your relationship a chance, make an effort, okay, so this is this is where the confusion comes in besides the sexual tendencies going on, okay, the, the, the desire, um, and then we have true love, and at the bottom of the deck we have forgiving and learning, okay, so, <clears throat> Let me just check the volume because I feel like sorry guys, it's working now. Monkey man, the monkey man. All right, I'm a little slow right now. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know what that's all about. I feel like my hands don't want to work, like they're jelly. Okay, like it's weird, and I don't know. Like I'm not even gonna go there. All right, it, I don't. It's like I'm not even gonna go there. Um, you know how like some like some people get shaky like after intercourse. All right, like I don't know what this is. I, I don't feel. I don't feel like the H word, okay, <laughs> the F and H word, but like, this is what my hands feel like right now, so it's like, I don't know what's going on with you, um, but I know that the, the chemistry, the, the attraction, like, right under the sexual organs are like, whoa, like, this is a very fertile time for somebody, okay, um, and I don't know if this, we're talking about the opposite sex again, because we were talking about the whole red and blue the other day, okay? And the the colors are swapped, but it's almost like he took his cloak off, you know, she took her robe off, they exchanged it. She's wearing blue here, lots of blue here, that's a blue orgasm for sure, okay? Plant orgasm, obviously, but we can use our imagination, ladies and gents. Um... But this is more, more than just sex. But, it, I mean, the sex right now is pretty important. I'm not feeling this music. I'm sorry. I have to change it. Your, your reading is really off, okay? I don't know why, nor can I explain it. Um, so let me see. If I change the music, it will help me. So right now, you know, the universe is saying, let's make an effort. All right, let's give it a chance. It is true love. All right, but you're, you're so confused. So I don't, I honestly, I don't know if your confusion is the past and, and like, I'm so confused because it's so sexual and it's so out of this realm, like the love you feel. And it's like, what the confusion is like, what? Like, I don't even know how to work with you right now. And somebody wants forgiveness. Somebody needs to release this energy, okay? And holy confusion. It's, it's not more confused like the opposite sex, same sex. I, I got off of that page, okay? But the confusion between the both of this is, like, I don't even know what to say. Like, if you guys haven't had a conversation, I don't even know how you would have a conversation. 
because I don't even, I don't, I wouldn't even know how to work in this. If I was in this energy trying to have a conversation, I would look like a dick or like I was drunk. You know what I'm saying? Like, and it's not like drunk in love. It's like the song that's on, you know, I wonder if you take me home. I don't know what this energy is. And it's like, I wanted to stop already and come back and they're like, don't do it. So maybe this is why this person hasn't made it to your place yet. The confusion is just too much. The the maybe they're trying to, or you're trying to figure out is this is this a sexual connection or is this like a a mind connection? And I'm telling you, it's it's both. Like you guys stimulate each part of your body. It's like somebody just wants to explore your body right now. Like explore it with their mouth, their tongue, their fingers, like the touch. It's insane. I want that person to come to my house. <laughs> but like, this is like, I can't. Oh, let me see if I get any anything more with this. I'm so sorry, guys. This is just the way it is. This is court. This is your reading. It wouldn't make any sense to redo it because this is the confusion. So it's funny I'm doing a video later. So we have the two of pence, all right? So it, and it, it's backwards. So it's that's what I'm saying. Like this person or you is so effing confused. And I, I am going to say the other person too because this is it's so, it's so mutual, this connection, this link. Okay, and it's questionable, but not questionable in a bad way. So with the two of pence being reversed, the, I mean, even it talks about even more confusion. You know, like, juggling, but to the point where they don't even know what they're juggling. Like, this is, like, dr this is more than, like, drunken love, okay? This is, like, whoa. Like, I bet you, like, good for you ladies or that can pull that off, but I bet you, like, you can think about this person and legitimately just have an orgasm. Like, you don't even have to touch yourself. I don't know if that's a thing for men, but I know for women it is. But, like, this is what this is. Like, this, like, whoa. Tell me about the Two of Cups. Holy shit. And, um, it's the Five of Wands and the Five of Swords, all right, with the Two of Cups. So this person, this, this masculine energy, you know, is, uh-oh and confused is it a lose lose like somebody lost there's a little bit of jealousy here all right i don't know if this person's still a snake but if it's a, they are a snake i mean the the freaking a strong ass snake and now i'm thinking of a penis okay oh my goodness gracious did you guys turn into saggies i'm gonna break this down for you later you're gonna understand why okay but like this is effing nuts. And you're looking right at this that just cracked. This actually looks like a woman's coochie, even though it looks nothing like a woman's coochie, okay? But you can look at it like that because this is what this is, okay? Like a great big giant confusion, but orgasms left and right, okay? And then he's got like this, like, he's looking, all right? He's like, I got this. You got that. It's electric. It's magnetic. It's electric. The electric slide, like, woo-wee, like, Sliding into freaking left field, okay? Like, but it's like, can I perform? Is it, a, like, this is, I can't even with you guys right now. I really can't. I, I, I would be really confused if this energy started kicking in for me, guys. This is complete sexual confusion and desire so for those who are not having this right now i am so sorry this is your reading but this king doesn't know what you know they obviously it's the two of cups they have this mutual feeling but i think they think it's a lost loss with you like they're still up and confused they really legitimately don't know what to do with themselves but i don't think you do either so i don't know if all of a sudden you guys got intimate if this person's touching themselves thinking about you like the chemistry is no joke I kind of feel like it's one of those things like, no, they're not calling you in, but they're thinking about you. But then I think what they do is they, they masturbate and then the next thing you know, 
it, it's right back to like, I'm not going to do this. So it's like the way they get rid of their sexual, <laughs> the sexual frustration is to like masturbate and, but then it doesn't help because the pheromones, you see, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's like, whoa, like they can smell you and they're not even touching you. This is crazy, guys. Tell me about confusion. I'm still confused. I mean, I'm not confused, but I'm, I'm confused. I'm in you guys' like confusion. So like it's it's clear as day what this is, but I'm confused as fuck. All right, and the Ace of Cups reverse, so it's like they're confused as fuck too because they're sitting. They're sitting on the Two of Cups. Do I love them? Do I not love them? Do I love them? Well, fuck. If you're questioning whether or not you love, you fucking love them. You know, this is how nuts this is. This doesn't talk about not enough love. All right, right underneath make an effort in true love. This is just confusing. This person's like, holy shit, what is this? Is this sexual desire? Is this lust? Is this passion? Is this chemistry? What is this? Is it love? Is this what love feels like? Like, no joke. Oh my god, I need a fucking cigarette. And it's take me in your arms. Don't you let me go. And these are all, all these cards are in the arms right now. I need you more and more. Let's continue. I need to get out of this. Tell me about chemistry. I'm going to literally have to get out of this. We got the Emperor reversed, all right? So this person's impatient, too. This person's, like, <laughs> they're angry. They're angry that they're still holding on to thoughts of you or something. They can't get rid of this pull. See how confused they are? So this is what I'm talking about. Like, this person doesn't even know how to handle this situation because they're out of control. Like, these thoughts, their mind, this, this chemistry, this pull, this desire is out of control. Could you imagine if this person's with somebody else? I couldn't. I Tell me about giving a relationship a chance. So the emperor's impatient, all right? They're super confused. Do I love her? Do I not love her? Or same sex. So, oh my gosh, reverse again. It's the, give your relationship a chance. So the, it's the ten of swords, but it's the end of it. But it, it's reverse. So this person's like not processing this love. The, the sexual and the love is like, whoa. Like, they could impregnate you spiritually. Nah, it's not a thing. Maybe it is. I don't know. I don't know anything about that. But that's that's in the ethers. Like, I, I can feel it. Like, so I now, I now I can feel it. And I said it earlier when I looked down here and I was like, nah, because I was focused up here. So they're doing that, too. They're thinking about you. Probably hoping that they can work you up. Is, is he or she feeling this, too? Like, but they're not processing this feeling. And it's a confusion feeling, guys, when you think you love somebody, but you're trying to figure out, is it desire or is it love? Is it sexual? Especially if you guys have, like, bomb intimacy. They can't figure it out, and I'm going to explain that later in a video why it's like that, too. It's more than what I've talked about before. And when I've had those experiences, I've actually had those, like, in the month of November. And I will break it down later. Tell me about making an effort. I can't even look at this any other way, guys. Unless I'm going to say, okay, this person's juggling and they just don't, you know, they love you, but they don't know what this love is and they're impatient. Like, they want to give it a chance, but they don't know how to process this. I mean, it's clear as day. Make an effort. See the chariot reverse. They don't know how to move forward. Could be talking about a Cancerian too. But they don't know how to move forward right now with you because of the confusion Love, desire, love, lust, love, lust, love, lust. They don't know what it is. And you're dealing with probably a, an adult that knows the difference, ladies and gents. But with this energy, they don't know. But I'm telling you, with this desire, th this person is going to freaking walk through the door and hem you up on the wall and tear your clothes off. All right? There's like... Th th oh. Holy macaroni. True love. Tell me about true love. I don't even know how you guys are going to get through this conversation. Your eyes and the way their eyes, you guys have like those snake eyes. Like it's like, um, it's like I explained this before back in the day. Like 
In Vedic, I'm known for having those type of eyes, like luring eyes, but they do too. So when you guys lock eyes, huh, yep, but just like that, all right? And now you got the six of pence, true love. So it's like either this is a gift for the divine or this person wants to balance out the scales. I feel like it's a gift from the divine. I'm not going to lie. Tell me about the six of pence. And this is not like a normal, like, they don't care about intimacy, guys. So if they're giving you this like that, like, they're going to want you to talk about it, express it, how to get there, you know, like, because it's like a trance thing. And it's, see, it's the father of Pence. So this is, this person wants to put an effort, all right? This person wants to balance out the scales. Or this is the divine giving you this, this gift, this person, okay? So, and then you got the mother of cups at the bottom. And look at, she's in La La Land too. Oh, she's got little orgasms floating out in the ethers everywhere. All right, like, woo-wee. All right, we got Grove. So somebody here has got a broken heart. And that's not even on here. <sighs> so it says, I next, the goddess of night. Okay. No, no, welcome to my Grove, my Groove. My grove, sorry. Heal your wounds, all right? It's time to heal and, and mend your heart, okay? So it says, now it's time to apologize to anyone you've harmed. Make friends whole again by choosing healing over pain. Choosing my beautiful grove is a powerful sign that you're a wander a strong point in your life with and show compassion and kindness to others. No one is perfect, yet imperfection is, is, is. If it's hurting now, it will pass. I will watch over you. If someone you love is hurting, take the time to be there for this person. The sacred groves heals all aches and pains, especially when the heart has been wounded. So I'm telling you right now, this person has broke your heart or vice versa. They want you to have compassion. So this person's going to come in like this. You guys, this is going to be the confusion. This is still on the board, but this is also talking about, this is why it's going to be so hard for somebody, I think, to make this effort and to give it a chance because they've been broken hearted. And when this person comes in, and I don't know if it's a Cancerian or Earth, Got fire here too. But here's like here's the deal. With give your relationship a chance and make the effort and the confusion. Like this person has broke you. And they don't know if you're gonna accept their love. Okay. So I can't believe I would just for a minute, guys, I was actually be able to give you a normal message with that one card to get me out of this thinking energy. And it's not bad energy, guys, but that's still the energy. Clear as day, that is that is the energy that it's just intense, okay? So if you can try to, like, get out of that energy and just focus on the bigger picture, what the universe is telling you, it, it's okay. Have compassion more than anger, okay? Because this person's worried that you're just gonna, that it's a lose-lose, and I'm not going to be judgmental right now anyway and say, you know, well, that's on them. or Because I don't know you guys' situation. You know what I'm saying? But the universe is literally saying, like, this is true love. Like, this is this feeling that you guys have. Like, it's nothing witchy, magical. It is, it, it's magical, but it's, it's the depth that the two of you take each other. Not too many people can do that. Like, even, like, if... A, Wow, I'm just going to leave it at that. Scorpio, Scorpio. Cards are slippery. Someone's sliding in. That was too many. Someone's sliding in. Okay. <sighs> a personal itch issue reaches resolution. I want to say there was a, a Zodiac, okay, on Raw Love that actually had these same two exact cards. If anybody knows, if they can please mention it, okay. Um, I want to say Aquarius definitely had that one. And so didn't, um, was it my Leo? 
It's come up in, before on one of the um, dailies too. But this means this is this is coming to a head. This is you know like it's not the only thing coming to a head, guys. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I didn't even laugh or chuckle at that because it's 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 true story. That that's how that. You, there's no way around that, guys. I don't know how you guys are going to keep your hands off of each other to even talk. And, and um, this could also be brand new energy coming at you and this is somebody's passing you scared shitless. But that's for people who don't have anyone in their lives right now. This is what this type of energy is going to be. But you also have to get yourself out of the confusion before the universe even bring anyone into you. You know what I'm saying? Because that's a new offer that you're going to be confused about because you're going to be like the same thing. Like maybe you just had a one night stand with somebody and they come back around or you have a one night stand in this energy and then you're like, what the fuck is this? All right. So use my glasses. I don't know. I'm going to struggle here. Things are likely to become very heated. Okay. This is an emotion sign that something is about to explode you know it's it's surrounding this question it's important to be sensitive to other people right now when you pull this card too and be sensible the, the sensibility is around you so tread carefully okay to move towards your goals and your dreams this card indicates that especially feminine time it, it heralds a time that you're gonna have to probably deal with family issues too nothing to worry about like that though it's a challenge you you come to it at the end all right so don't worry about it this card suggests that both a domestic matter and a private issue will soon be resolved and come to a head. It is a great time to move house as well. The answer is your question lies beneath this kind leader, being a kind leader. This is time for you to step up and agree to overcome your insecurities as well. And I don't see those here either because of everything else, okay? So we have a broken heart and a little insecurity. All right, uh, attuned to the moon, this may be the best time to move forward what you want, even in a sideways manner. It says meditate, don't be clingy, stop sulking. All right, spend some time with the family if you need to. So, um, I want you in like the water energy too. You are in the water energy, but you're in a different type of water energy. They want you in this type of energy, nurturing, compassion. All right, um, don't worry, all will be well. Don't worry, all will soon be well. Okay, so this is, like I said, coming to a head. All right, there's, there's no way around this. Um, so... I, I wish you guys um, the best of luck getting through this because it's difficult because we do have broken hearts here too, okay? Or one. It, it doesn't, regardless, all right? And, and then with just the energy itself, this is a very, very emotional conversation as well, guys. It's not just going to be all sex, believe that, It's but the sex is going to be out of this world, all right? But this person is, is so confused love or not love and one or the other knows it's what it already is and they had had their heart broken all right so obviously you know that other person didn't have that love when this other person did they probably had feelings but they didn't even know what those were all right it was probably just sexual feelings but now it's like intensified to like the max all right so um you don't want to have babies use protection yo use protection and i would do more than just more than just a condom all right those things slip off too so uh, best of luck love you guys bye